Hello, this uh, video is to help our customers that have purchased the Ctrader Moving Average um, trading strategy with source code. So this product is sold with source code. I'm going to show you how you can actually um, edit this with Visual Studio and how to load it up into um, Ctrader Desktop, okay? So this is the product. If you have purchased this product or any one of our products that includes source code, then this video will help you out in getting started. So what I'm going to do is show you um, here. I'll start with the fact that you've downloaded the product from our website, which would be this uh, zipped up file. If I just double click on it, um, I just have to drag this across one second. And you can see that it's actually got a folder here with the project source code in it. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to unzip this or uncompress it. So extract all. Okay. Now that's going to go ahead and unstrap. Extract, just doing it now. Now there's a lot of third party libraries in there for um, Telegram and other things. So um, the file size is a lot bigger than you probably would normally get for a normal CBOT. And this is why we also um, recommend that people actually use uh, Visual Studio for editing the project. Now here it is, it's, in, it's been downloaded. Okay, there's the source code there. Now I want to grab this folder here, which is the one above and copy it. I then go to my robots folder and I paste it. Okay, it's now going in. It's now in the robots folder. So then I go to um, C Trader Desktop. And if you're in the trade window at the top here, you just want to go to the Automate tab. Under the Automate tab, you find the product that we've just um, put in there. So it's the MA Crossover Strategy. And you can see it's not been built. And this is because you can't build it from within um, C Trader Desktop. But if you click on the actual C by itself, you can see that it shows all the source code. Okay, this is all the source code for the product. Now, if I actually go ahead and build, you can see it's not building the file. This is because you need to do it through Visual Studio. So if I right click on the folder, sorry, on the CBOT instance, and edit in Visual Studio, this is going to open up Microsoft Video Stu sorry, Visual Studio 2019. Now, at the moment of this video, um, this is showing you how to do it with CTrader 4.1 and um, Visual Studio 2019. Now, very soon Ctrade is going to launch um, version 4.2 and we do have a vid another video to show you how to do it on 4.2 but it's pretty much will be the same thing what will happen is on um, 4.2 um, when you edit it it will open up you can still use visual studio 2019 but you can also use 2020 okay so this is just 2019 so this will come up and show you the project folders and now you can go into it and edit it okay one thing you might notice is the reference the calgo api might not be referenced you might have an error there so if I was to remove that for any reason and you need to add it again, you need to browse it and discover it in your C Trader API directory. So this would be under robots, sorry, Cialgo. So it'd be under documents, Cialgo, API, and there's the API. You need to make a reference to that. So you might have a problem with it building that this reference will have a little X or a little um, error mark on it. So make sure that's referenced. Now, if I actually go ahead and build it and I look at the output folder, OK, it's actually going to build the um, file because it's got um, a connection already to the CBOT um, to create CBOT. It's actually created an algo file in the robots directory. So you can put this anywhere you want. But in this case, we've got it actually in the robots directory. Now it's created a um, algo file. So if I go back to um, here, you can see it's now been built. I can now add a CBOT instance and I can go ahead and run it. And if you look at the log, it tells you it started. OK, so that's how you would do it for one of our projects that uses third party libraries. You can't build it from within C Trader itself. Sorry, C Trader um, development environment itself. You've got to go to Visual Studio to build it. I hope that helps you. If you do have any problems or any issues regarding doing this, come to this website here, which is um, ctrader.info. Go to um, something like I think it's um, CBOT coding. And you can post your questions here, any problems you've got actually um, loading this in. We actually did this for one of our customers that have had some problems um, looking at the source code for this same product, the MA crossover strategy. So we hope this video will help them and also help any other customers that um, are stuck in the same sort of position. Okay, thank you very much. If you do like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you.